All right, here we go. Day two of the Big 12 Media Days and Baylor took center stage today in Arlington as the season gets closer and closer. Yeah, it's Dave Aranda's first opportunity at the preseason spectacle as he actually enters his second season in Waco. Sports director Curtis Quillen is live from AT&T Stadium with more on what he's expecting from the Bears entering the fall. Hey, Curtis. Yeah, guys, when Dave Aranda was just a couple of days from his first spring practice at Baylor, COVID-19 shut down the world. Now he is heading into year two, having had a full offseason, and it has him incredibly energized about his Baylor squad. The Bears need to replace a quarterback, but have actually had the chance to be together and work on a new offense, improving a defense and frankly, just bonding. Something they weren't able to do as we got through the heat of the pandemic this time last year. That simple ability to interact face to face is making an enormous difference in the Bears preparation for the coming season without even factoring in the extra practice time that that allows. The ability to have the one on ones to when um, you know, our players are eating their meals and for me to, to step in there and sit down with them and talk about their families, talk about their life, talk about their classes, talk about uh, what they're going through. Those, are th those times propel the times that you're on the grass. Aranda's Bears got a full pre-spring, spring, and post-spring and summer, including the green and gold games return. Now he also talked about the quarterback battle to replace Charlie Brewer, who recently transferred to Utah. So what's he looking for? We'll have that answer for you coming up at 6 and 10 o'clock tonight. For now, we're live in Arlington at Big 12 Media Days. I'm Curtis Quillen, 6 News at 5. We'll be right back.